Uh, systems that are terraform that you can land on. Right. Okay. Because otherwise, Before there's no doing point. SpaceX. Right. So there's a reason to actually get out of your ship and, and, and look at things. Okay. Yeah, that's because actually... what's the point right now? Landing on a moon and just walking on nothing, just yeah, rocks. Walking on some rocks and some dirt. That is actually a very perfect idea from... This is why I like Frontier. I mean, I give them a lot of shit for their bugs, but they actually thought it through. They're going to make Space Legs last so that up until Space Legs, they're going to put things in the game that are going to be beneficial once and after when they add Space Legs. So like the planetary... Uh, the atmospheric landings, you'll be able to get out of your ship and walk around in the grass... That is what they're going to do before Space Legs. I can totally get that idea. That is a really good idea. Way to go, Frontier. That way, that way. No, I'm very impatient. I really want to walk around. Yeah, yeah. I, 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 I am too. Uh huh. Well, yeah. Uh huh. Um. I, I like it how they're going to prep the game for everything before Space Legs so that when they add Space Legs, it's only a benefit to the game, not something that, well, it, it was nice, but it, it has no functional purpose kind of thing. And I actually like the route that they're taking. All right, that's enough of that. Um, yeah. I wouldn't mind being able to walk around my ship, though. Dude, I... I, I Even as an early thing. I would, I'd love to. At least let us get out of our chair, dude. Can I, come on. Like you don't have to, you don't have to model the entire station. Just let me fucking walk around the ship, just please. I don't have you to think about it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We all hop on Super Dave's anaconda. Yeah. Why are we gonna try today to make a group picture? Uh, when everybody gets on, whenever we have time, um, maybe tomorrow night. Okay. When the server goes down, I mean, I don't know. Or before it goes down. Um, Tomorrow night. Today's Wednesday. I mean, today's Tuesday. Today's Tuesday. Tomorrow's Wednesday night. Tomorrow night is when the server shuts down. Um, what was I gonna say? Yeah, yeah, basically. Um, I think I, I think I calculated right. What is what is the GMT right now? Uh, no, uh, the GMT uh, around is uh, out in our American time. It's seven in the morning. So it would be the 7 in the morning of Thursday. Okay, because the server yeah. resets 7 o'clock London time in the morning. So what time would that be here? That's the question I'm trying to 3 in to the ask. morning. 3 in the morning. Okay, 3 o'clock. It's, it's usually about 2 or 3, yeah. Yeah, okay. All right. So just future reference. Um, yeah, those are those messages. The game is shutting down. You hurry up or get fucked. I mean, you know, that kind of thing. Um... The whole, all right, so the whole, all right, my personal thing on power play, for me anyway, is I'm not going to five. Fuck that, dude. This is five, rank five is going to be way too much work. And I'm like, no, nah, I don't care. No, it's not. Only five hour work, Arn, man. That's easy. Yes, yes, yes. And y'all go by my side, we're going to do 5,000 in two hours. Oh, that's right, because you're doing the undermining. See, see, I've never gotten into undermining because yeah. I didn't know what it was about. All right, well, well, we'll dabble in it. We'll see what happens. Look, if I, Jargo got in an hour 800 merits in an hour, one hour. Yeah. And then he lost it because he didn't want to combat log. And then after that, in an hour more, he got 600 merits. That's what, 1,600? Yeah, yep, yep. Sweet diggity dog. Um. Yeah, the python. I would love. Yeah, I can totally maintain rank four because I spend two million credits and I deliver my fifteen hundred supplies, <coughs> and I'm golden. <coughs> rank five scares me. I am in the process of picking up my anaconda and bringing it back home. Sweet. Rank five scares me. Yeah, Ten. Sadly, I'm all the way up to you, so it's gonna take a bit. Jargo has an anaconda, but since Jargo doesn't know how to fight in it, he doesn't use it. <laughs> he just has a trophy. He has it as a trophy somewhere. It's a safety deposit box. Oh, shit. I, that... I wouldn't consider it not knowing how. I would consider it not being able to 
<laughs> okay, okay. Right. Okay. Um, I couldn't take that part. Uh, yeah, we're in Dave's. Not we're mine. In mine. And I'm still in uh, projector mode. Yeah. You mean sovereign? Uh, Super Dave's. No, we're, we're in mine. Dave's. Mine, mine. We're in mine, mine. Yeah, we're in Dave's. Dave um, has a private session. Yes, because oh, yeah. Sovereign I lost gold he, a little bit yeah. after you did, and, yeah. Uh, well, I'm not in Dave's, but uh, I just picked up the Alliance contracts, and if you want to invite me, I can join yours and then head back to Gateway and drop them off. Copy. Uh, you have already been invited. Auto. Uh, or better yet, let me fly to Gateway now, and you guys can uh, invite me whenever you're up. Or, Okay, you are. You, I've already sent the invite to join the private group to you already. You just have to check uh, the thingamajig with the stuff uh, in the friends yeah. private groups thing. Right. Oh, yeah. I just plotted a route to uh, Gateway. You know, since I already have it, I'm just gonna right. save an exit. Um. Okay, so this is what I was thinking of doing. Uh, what? Go ahead. One one thing, sorry to interrupt. Go ahead. Sorry, uh, you you did say you were inviting some invites to the club. I have not seen that. Okay, uh, let me verify that. Right, right, right. Good thing. Um, Red Star Line. 